Most of the time it's a lot of fun, but sometimes things go wrong. Well, I left the barbecue lighter a little bit too close to the barbecue after I lit it, and that's what happened. The barbecue is there, and this thing just caught in flames and shot out some jets of fire. It's very dangerous. Oh no, what's going on with our brakes? We had some trouble with the brakes coming down from the bristlecone pine trees. The right front caliper was smoking. We found Arnold's garage in Pentaluma, and they were very helpful. The mechanic worked very hard on the brakes, cleaning everything up and uh, lubricating the slides for the brakes. It's all working fine again now. Slide back and forth like that. This one. There's an actual chunk broken right out of the rotor here, a little hole in it. Fellas has never seen that before either. I sure haven't. laptop was giving us an awful lot of trouble, so I decided to upgrade it to a solid-state hard drive. We'll see how that works. Our laptop was giving us some difficulty, too. I reformatted it, put it back to basics, reinstalled all my photographs and all of our software. Still a bit hinky, so I decided to upgrade it to a solid-state hard drive. Here's what you need to do that, a cable and a new hard drive. Once the software is installed and the hard drive is plugged into the cord, it's pretty simple. We just let the process go along cloning the drive. Remove these two screws. Put them over there so we don't lose them. And we'll just take my little special knife and get under there and we'll pop that. Okay, so there's the old hard drive. Here's the new hard drive. So we've got a couple screws to pull out, take it out, change it over. Okay. Taking out the old hard drive and replacing it with a new one. Doing all this in the van on the road with uh, limited tools. Okay, now we take out this hard drive. Sand disk drive. And we put the screws back in. Now when everything lines up, we just push it into place like that. It's locked down, we put the screws in, we're done. There's only one screw that holds this whole tray in, actually. And that's it right there. There. Then we put the cover back on and we're done. Okay, done. Tremendous success. The laptop is better than new. It's working just great.